Hey, I want to give you one word to meditate on during this season. This is an incredibly difficult season. It continues to be an incredibly difficult season. But I think this is the most important word for you and for your family right now. And the word is together. The word is together. Uh, we take this so seriously as a church that we actually provide multiple gatherings because of this COVID reality, because some people aren't comfortable coming in person to church, we continue to provide these online gatherings. But this is my fear, this is my suspicion, and this is my caution for you. My suspicion is that if you don't gather in person, it's not that you're actually engaging online and you're just not engaging in person. The truth is that it's either in person or, or really nothing right now. And that's the mistake I don't think you can afford to make. I think that your children's spiritual future, I think that your family's connection with Jesus, I think that your, you know, your definition of thriving, I think that you were meant to be united in relationship with your creator and encouraged in relationship with other believers. And you're choosing right now, I'm afraid, some version of isolation to go it alone, to just sort of disconnect. And that's the one thing I don't think you can afford to do. Uh, I, right now, if your family needs to connect online, connect online. If your family can connect in person, connect in person. But don't do this alone. Don't allow isolation to become your spiritual reality, even if distance has to be your social reality. Let's do this together.